Hi guys and welcome to Intuition Study Services. In today's episode of Lightning Maths, we'll be looking at a really quick and easy way to learn, know and remember the 4 times table using the brick method. So let's take a look. Ok so the first thing you want to do is to draw 5 rows of a brick pattern going 3 by 2. So we want 3 bricks in the first row, 2 bricks in the second row, 3 bricks in the third row, 2 bricks in the fourth row and 3 bricks in the fifth row and so on. Then what we do, step 2, is we fill in the bricks with even numbers or the 2 times table starting from 0 and ending at 8. This is the general pattern for the 2 times table. So we complete the bricks with this pattern. So we put 0 in the first brick, then 2, then 4, then 6, then 8. And we repeat that pattern in the bricks below. 0, 2, 4, 6, 8. And then in the last row, since there are 3 bricks, we can notice that only 0, 4 and 8 appear in that row. So we just fill that in with 0, 4 and 8. Then step 3, we fill in the top row with zeros. We fill in the second row with 1s, the third row with 2s, the fourth row with 3s and the fifth row with 4s. And if you haven't noticed already, there's the 4 times table. So we've got 0 times 4 is 0, 1 times 4 is 4, 2 times 4 is 8, 3 times 4 is 12, 4 times 4 is 16, 5 times 4 is 20, 6 times 4 is 24, 7 times 4 is 28, 8 times 4 is 32, 9 times 4 is 36, 10 times 4 is 40, 11 times 4 is 44, and 12 times 4 is 48. And if you do this a few times, you'll be able to do the 4 times table in a matter of seconds, and you'll know it fluently, just like that, off the top of your head. Let me know how well you did with this in the comments below. Ok so everybody should have done well with that but if you feel you need a bit more practice then feel free to rewind this video and you can work through the technique again. If you found this tutorial helpful then do leave a like, comment, share with anyone who you think this could benefit and do subscribe for all the latest lightning maths, tips, tricks, revision and exam techniques. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.